What is up guys, John here, and welcome back to another Destiny video. Today is Friday, as you can see by the crowd of people over there, around a mysterious person. Zer's back in the tower, real quick. As you can see by the Vanguard people over here, he's uh he's picked his spot right here, so we're going to just go ahead and see what he has to sell for this week. This week he has an insurmountable skull fort for the Titan, it hits replenish grenade energy, replenish health when you pick up an orb, and Storm Fist kills regenerate health and spawn with melee energy. Knucklehead Raider for the Hunter. Grenade hits restore melee energy or super energy from non guardian kills. And radar remains visible while aiming while aiming primary weapons. Definitely a nice perk. And for the Warlock, we have the Claws of Ahamkara. The uh, only DLC from this uh, exotic inventory that he has today to, to sell. So with this, you gain an additional charge for Scorch and Energy Drain, increase reload speed with special weapons, and increase melee attack speed. Definitely nice. And for the exotic weapon, he has the Red Death. Each kill heals you and speeds up reload. It's easier to aim using this weapon under fire. Definitely a, a good gun, seeing as the 1.1.1 uh, buff came out recently, uh, from what I've heard. A lot of pulse rifles, especially the Red Death and the, is the Bad Juju, have been seen a lot in Crucible, pretty much because they're extremely useful nowadays. And he has the Exotic Shard, again, seven for uh, seven strange coins for one, one Exotic Helmet Engram. For the upgrades, he has the Mask of the Third Man and the Lucky Raspberry, almost same 14. Helm of Insmono, oh no, not the Helm. Helm of Inmol Slay is what I wanted to say. And confused with this one up here. Uh, he also has the Light Beyond Nemesis and the Sunbreakers. The weapons, he has the Hard Light, Red Death, the uh, Universal Remote, Land C, Patience and Time, and Truth Rocket Launcher. And round off, he has the Scout Rifle, Machine Gun, and the Rocket Launcher Telemetry. He has the upgrades for the vehicle, which is the Emerald Coil and the Void Drive. Again, he's selling heavy ammo to synthesis. He's Seems to be selling these uh, quite frequently now, which is definitely good so people don't have to fill up their entire bank like I did with uh, just heavy ammo sense. But there you go, there you have it guys. Pick up a red death, definitely good for uh, PvP, especially since it's got that buff. So I want to thank you guys for watching, hope you enjoyed, see you in the next one.